What's up guys, Joe Meglio here, BaseballBeast.com. I have another video blog post for you today. Uh, I got a question here, I'm from Chad, let me read it to you guys. Chad asks, what are your thoughts on the use of weighted baseballs in conjunction with your baseball strength and conditioning <laughs> workouts and how should they or shouldn't be used? So uh, first off Chad, I've never used weighted baseballs before on myself or recommended them to any of my athletes and here's why. Um, you know, many athletes have a shitty throwing program. You know, if they're in high school or college, their coaches don't put them on a specific training program. I mean, I'm sorry, throwing program. Uh, so many of them are going, you know, they're starting their season in February or March without, you know, a solid uh, throwing program after fall ball. So, you know, I'm definitely not going to compound that problem by having them use weighted balls. Now, if uh, I was in a more, uh, I guess, setting where, you know, I controlled everything, maybe there would be a place for it. But, you know, unless your throwing program is spot on and, you know, you're throwing in like November and December, long tossing, really building up your arm strength and then throwing off a flat ground in January. And, you know, once the season starts in like February or March, start throwing off a mound. You know, unless I'm controlling those factors, I'm not going to really recommend uh, weighted balls for, for, you know, any baseball player, really. Um, the other problem I have with them is that it's like swinging a weighted bat. You know, if the ball's too heavy, it could throw your change, uh, your, it could change your throwing mechanics. And that's definitely not a good thing. It's gonna, you know, put your arm in a weird uh, position. It could really throw off your timing. So, you know, that's another concern I have. So basically, the only people I'd ever recommend weighted balls to are those under the supervision of, you know, a coach who really, really knows what they're doing. And so, you know, maybe a high level prospect who needs to, add some miles per hour on to get seriously considered to play pro ball or something like that. I don't deal with a ton of kids like that or athletes like that. I don't use weighted balls with my guys, so I'm not really going to recommend them to you. Some people have different opinions than me. That's cool, but I just wanted to give you take my take on that. All right, so hopefully that answered your question, Chad. Keep sending your questions in, guys. Joe Megs here, BaseballBeast.com. Talk to you soon. Peace.